My name is Velma Demerson. When I was 18, I, I ran off to marry a Chinese man. I would be in his apartment. It was just really pleasant, you know. We decided to get married at some point. My mother notified my father that I'd run off with this Chinese guy. The police came in. Then I was seized and taken to the police court. I never saw my boyfriend again. In a few minutes, I went before the judge. I told the judge, oh, I'll get married if you just let me out of here. He said, I sentence you to the Mel Belmont home for one year. Women between the ages of 15 and 35 years old could be arrested as incorrigible, and that covered just about anything they decided that might be immoral. And the Female Refuges Act was a provincial law passed by the Ontario government and allows them to be held in the Belmont House for a period up to two full calendar years. I got into a state of complete fear. We got locked in. There's a chain and a padlock. And they used to call it a fire trap. I was subjected to a lot of surgery, as many as 10 times without anesthetic. As far as I'm concerned, she wanted that baby dead. 81-year-old Velma Demerson wants the government to acknowledge it made a mistake when it put her in jail for living with her Chinese boyfriend. Three months pregnant, Velma was put in the Mercer Reformatory under Ontario's Female Refuges Act. I bring you the apology from the government of Canada mm. for taking away your citizenship, mm. for having been imprisoned. In 2002, the apology. In 2003, the settlement. And she didn't pursue any other legal remedy after that. But uh, she still had her concerns. Of course, she never got full justice. I think the most important thing that I'd like to convey to women is it's not your fault.